Hey guys, good evening and welcome back again to your Unacademy Need English channel. I hope all of you are doing great, having a good time. So my dear students, this particular session again is for all the NEET 2025 aspirants. I'll be discussing a lot of important things when it comes to the NEET 2025 examination, particularly uh, from the subject chemistry, that is my subject, yeah? So my dear students, there are few questions which I believe will be in your mind at this particular point of time. Number one, what are the fundamental chapters which you need to cover first, right? There are definitely some fundamental, fundamental chapters in, uh, let's say, physical chemistry, inorganic chemistry, organic chemistry. If you skip those fundamental chapters, you cannot move ahead in the other chapters of physical, organic or inorganic. Number one. Number two, what are the high weightage chapters, particularly in the subject chemistry? What should be the sequence of the chapters which you are supposed to follow in physical, organic and inorganic? And which NCRT you are supposed to follow, right? Whether you have to follow the old NCRT or the new NCRT. I believe these are the four questions which will be in your mind at this particular point of time. And let me address all of them one by one. My dear students, the first thing. The three fundamental chapters of chemistry which you need to cover at an earliest, right? That includes mole concept, the fundamental chapter of uh, physical chemistry. Without this chapter, your physical chemistry can never be strong. Chemical bonding. Chemical bonding. You cannot start the organic chemistry without clearing chemical bonding. So chemical bonding plays a role, right? If you want your organic chemistry to be strong, then your chemical bonding has to be very, very, very strong, right? Then, then comes your general organic chemistry. My dear students, you cannot jump into class 12th organic chemistry without doing the general organic chemistry first. So I believe these are the three fundamental chapters which you have to prioritize at an earliest. Right. So if you need to, if you are starting physical chemistry, you have to start with uh, the general organic chemistry. Right. If you want to start organic chemistry, first try to cover the concepts of uh, this chemical bonding. Then you can start the organic chemistry. Do not jump into the organic chemistry directly. Right. Try to cover uh, the GOC first. Right. Now, people, what is going to be? What are the high weighted chapters when it comes to the NEET 2025 chemistry syllabus? My dear students, I have mentioned all the high weighted chapters over here. You cannot skip a single chapter out of these. Atomic structure, minimum two questions you'll get, right? Thermodynamics, uh, including thermochemistry, three to four questions. Equilibrium, again, three to four questions. GOC, again, three to four questions. Hydrocarbon, again, three to four questions. Electrochemistry, minimum three questions, right? And if you add redox with it, then it's going to be uh, redox plus electro, three to four questions. Chemical kinetics, Three questions. Coordination chemistry, three questions. LDIDs, ketones, carboxylic acids, three to four questions. And your chemical bonding. Chemical bonding, it's again high weightage. Four to five questions for sure in this chapter. So these are your high weightage chapters when uh, you talk about the subject chemistry, right? Now, what has to be the sequence of the chapters which you are supposed to follow? My dear students, if you are starting your physical chemistry, if you are starting your physical chemistry, then you have to start with the mole concept. Once you are done with the mole concept, go to redox reactions. Once you are done with redox reactions, then comes your electrochemistry. After electro, thermodynamics, then equilibrium, then chemical kinetics, then solution, and at the end, atomic structure. This has to be the sequence of the chapters which you are going to follow for your physical chemistry. When you talk about inorganic, in inorganic, you are going to start with periodic classification, then you will go to chemical bonding, then you will go to coordination chemistry, and then at the end, you can go for the DNF block elements, right? And after that, you can consult your P block as well, right? There is P block as well in your syllabus, just consult that at the end. When you talk about the organic chemistry, first GOC, followed by isomerism, then comes your hydrocarbon. After hydrocarbon, you'll go for haloalkanes arenes, then alcohol, phenol, ether, and at the end, it's going to be aldehydes, ketones, and carboxylic acids, right? So this is the sequence which you're going to follow in physical. This is the sequence which you're going to follow in your inorganic, and this is the sequence which you're going to follow in your organic chemistry. My dear students, you cannot directly start alcohols, phenols, ethers without doing uh, GOC isomerism, hydrocarbon, etc., etc. So it's the sequence which you have to follow. Right? You cannot directly, you cannot directly start, let's say, equilibrium without covering these chapters, without covering the earlier chapters. So try to follow the same sequence if you want your concepts to be super strong. Right? Moving ahead. <clears throat> Moving ahead. Now, 
lot of students must be thinking about which NCRT you should follow. My dear students, my dear students, you have to follow the new NCRT now, right? You have to follow the new NCRT. But you know, in your new NCRT, P block is not mentioned. But P block, you have to consult from old NCRT. But other than that, other than that, what you have to do, you have to follow the new NCRT. You are not going to rely on the old NCRT now, right? Okay, follow the new NCRT because now it's going to be the new NCRT from which the questions are going to be made, right? Old NCRT is gone. It's over now, right? It's over. It's completely over. Perfect. So I believe all your questions are cleared here. And there is one quick update for all the NEET 2025 aspirants, right? All those students who are going to write the NEET uh, examination uh, in 2025, either for the first time, second time, third time or whatever. My dear students, my dear students, tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow on 25th of May, exactly at 7 p.m. we are starting, we are having our first class in the Phoenix 2.0 NEET English batch, right? Uh, what is this Phoenix 2.0 NEET English batch? My dear students, this particular batch is completely dedicated to all the NEET 2025 aspirants, wherein we guys, an academy NEET English team, me, Yavar sir, Ambika ma'am, HSP sir, Pankhudi ma'am, we are going to train you throughout this journey of one year in all the subjects in detail. The best part about this particular batch, your whole syllabus is just getting complete in six months, starting from 25th of May, starting from tomorrow right in just six months your whole syllabus of physics chemistry biology will be completed every chapter will be started from the basics so if you have not studied the chapter before no worries at all right we are going to start the chapter in such a way considering that you have not studied the chapter before right and 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 all the theory which is included in the chapter all the problem patterns which are included in the chapter all the theory problem patterns right we are going to discuss in the classes in the live classes itself right and people the best part is after we are done with the with the complete syllabus in six months then we are dedicating two complete months for the revision two complete months we are dedicating for the revision so basically in six plus two eight months your syllabus is not only being covered once your syllabus is being covered twice right one in the detailed manner in six months followed by the two months revision plan followed by the two months revision plan, which we shall be doing with all of you, right? See guys, in six months, we have to complete the whole syllabus, right? That means we have made in this particular batch, we have designed the weekly targets. Like uh, there are three, three and a half chapters, which we are going to complete in a particular week, right? And once we complete those three, three and a half chapters in one week, the Sunday of that week, you will have to write the test. So basically on every Sunday, we have kept tests in this particular batch exactly from 2 p.m. to 5.20 p.m. the same way as your NEET examination is scheduled, right? So on every Sunday, your tests will be scheduled. Whatever portions we are going to complete in a particular week, Sunday of that week, we are going to have the test of that completed portion. Now you can imagine how many tests you are going to write in this one year because every Sunday we are going to keep the tests, right? Now, DPPs and study material, you are not going to follow any book apart from the DPPs and study material which we are going to provide you in this particular batch. This is going to be the finest DPPs and study material, my dear students, which you are getting in this particular batch. Apart from NCRT and these DPPs, you are not supposed to follow any book. No book at all you are supposed to follow, right? Close down all the books. Just, just, just try to solve the DPPs which we are going to provide you after the completion of every chapter in this particular batch. And my dear students, one more important thing, the best thing in this particular batch, after you write the chapter wise test on Sunday, we will analyze your scores and we will have one-on-one -on -one mentorship sessions with you, wherein we will keep on letting you know how you can improvise your scores when it comes to the test, right? So six plus two is eight months. In the ninth month, my dear students, we'll make you write almost, almost, 30 full syllabus mock tests in one go, right? So in 30 days, you will have to write 30 full syllabus mock tests at the end. And we are going to provide you those 30 full syllabus mock tests in this particular batch. You need not to worry about that as well. The batch is starting tomorrow, my dear students. Tomorrow is the first class, 25th of May, exactly at 7 p.m. So I would want every one of you to get enrolled into the batch right now because I do not want you guys to miss out any single, any single session. Okay, and one more thing, one query which I have been getting from students. Sir, what if we, uh, due to some emergency, we miss uh, like any live session? You need not to worry about that as well. 
right? Recordings of the live sessions will be also provided to you, right? You need not to worry about that. After every live session, you can have the access to the recording of that live session as well throughout this particular year of the preparation with your Unacademy Nate English team, right? So my dear students, basically all the parameters which are required to crack this particular examination with an amazing score. If you are targeting 700 plus, then this particular match is for you. If you are targeting 700 plus in the need 2025, whether you are writing it for the first time, second time, third time, does not matter, right? Then this particular batch is for you. It is for you and it's going to be our under, I mean, it's going to be under our mentorship basically. Yeah. So people, let me quickly show you how do you get enrolled into the batch. The video which you guys are currently watching, yeah? The video which you guys are currently watching, in the video you'll find a link in the description. The link will be, a one-year subscription for NEET UG. You have to click on that link. When you click on that link, my dear students, over here, you will see two plans. A plus subscription or iconic subscription. Any one of the two you have to take. What is the difference between the two? In the plus subscription, you get study material in the form of PDF. In the iconic subscription, you get study material in the form of booklets. And those booklets will be delivered to your houses from an academy side through couriers, right? And uh, I mean, you'll be getting the courier of your booklets once you enroll into the batch right over here you have to select the 12 months click on proceed to pay and after clicking on proceed to pay my dear students you'll be directed to one more page ah uh, let me quickly show that to you why it's not happening right now yes okay so you'll be directed to this page over here you have to put your mobile number or you can continue with your email id on which you'll be getting the otp and everything and eventually you'll be getting enrolled into the batch just at 5499 right just at 5499 you are having the access to this particular batch. And once you enroll into this batch, you'll be having the access to all the batches of Unacademy absolutely free of cost, right? If you're the part of Phoenix 2.0 Need English batch, you'll be having the access to all the batches of Unacademy, right? All the batches of Unacademy, whether the English batch, Hindi batch, English batch, right? All the batches of Unacademy access, you'll be having absolutely free of cost, right? And the cost is right now 5499. So get enrolled right now on priority because I really do not want you guys to miss out the first session with us on the Unacademy platform. So I'll see you tomorrow exactly at 7 p.m. That is our first live session, right? That is the first session which I am taking personally, right? So let's meet up tomorrow exactly at 7 p.m. Take care. God bless you all. Love you all. Get enrolled right after this session. Bye-bye.